Let's take a look at finding the relative min max of a function using the HP prime calculator. And let's take a look at this problem. We've got f of x is equal to 2x to the third minus 3x squared minus 12x plus 1. Okay. Well, if you're not already in the apps, you can press your apps button to get here. And we won't go into function, so highlight function, press enter. We go backspace, delete out what's there. And we got 2x, then the x to the y button, third power, right arrow, get out of the exponent, minus 3x, and then more x squared, minus 12x, plus 1. Enter. Okay, now we're going to press plot, and that's what our graph looks like. Okay, now um, relative min, relative max, uh, that's not your highest point or lowest point. That's where it changes from increasing, decreasing, or decreasing, increasing. So this right here would be a relative max. And down here off the screen that I can't see is a relative min. Okay, so I'm going to press my menu. And um, then there's a function option here. If you choose function, then you can uh, down arrow and choose extremum. Uh, the extremum refers to min and max. Relative min and relative max, that is. So I'm going to press enter on it. And it comes back and tells us uh, we have an extremum at negative 1, 8. And you see where the cursor is. And you have to you have to look at it and tell what it is, so the calculator won't tell you that. It's a relative max. Relative max is at negative one eight. Well, we know the graph's coming up like that, reaching a high point, coming down, and reaching a low point, turning back around. So it must be a relative min down here. Now, what to find that? If I were to uh, click OK here, if I were to choose function and choose extremum again press enter, it finds the same one. You have to actually move your cursor close to the one you're trying to find. So if I do my right arrow key, you see that cursor moving down the graph. I'll put it about eh, right there. It just needs to be closer to the other one. And now I'll choose function. Down arrow to extremum, press enter, and it goes down and finds that one down there. And you see there's a little arrow here indicating that it's down there. Um, if you, um, and I'm pretty sure you can do this with your calculator or the emulator. If I click with my mouse and hold down, then I can uh, scroll it up like that so I can see it. And then you can uh, see 2, negative 19. And that would be our relative min. So 2, negative 19. And those would be our answers. And I'll click OK there. And again, I can move this back like that to put it back where it was. Uh, and then press apps. That will bring you back here. That's finding relative min and relative max on uh, HP Prime. Got